In this video, I show you how to add your game to a Roblox group. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like. And let's jump straight into this guide. So the first thing we actually need to do is go and open up Roblox Studio. So I've already got it open up here. Um, you can go and open up Roblox Studio from your desktop or from within Roblox as well. And this guide is going to work if you've got an existing game on Roblox and if you've got a new one as well. So I'm going to go and create a new game for this example. So I'm going to go and click on classic base plate and let it launch. And then I'm going to show you how you can go and add this game to your robots group. So once you're in the, the game, what you want to do is go to the top right and go and tap on file. Then we've got a few different options here. And what you want to do is go and firstly, make sure you've actually saved it to Roblox. Saving it to Roblox doesn't actually make the game playable but it does mean that it's saved to Roblox and we can make some changes and things like that. So we need to start off with save to Roblox as. Then what we need to do is go and you can choose the existing game or go into the bottom left and click create new game, which we need to do in this case. And then we can go and name it. So I'm just going to go and name this um, video guide or something like that. Just so you guys know, you can add any description you'd like as well. Now, what's really important is, is that you come down to creator and we need to go and tap on it. It says me because it's yourself at the moment. Um, and you need to go and choose the group you want to go and add the game to. So in this case, I'm going to go and add it to guide around subscribers. So I'm going to go and tap on that just like so. And we've now gone and added it and you can go and change the other settings. They don't really matter. Then you can go and tap save and we've now gone and basically save the game. You may have already done this though, but you know, just bear with me. We can now move on to the next step um, and it's just loading. And now that you've gone and saved it to a robots group, what we can now do is go to the top left again and go and tap on file and then go and tap on publish to Roblox, just like that. And that's literally it. You don't need to go and click on publish to Roblox as because we've already saved it to our robots group. And that's literally it. And we'll go and get um, a message in the bottom left saying publish new changes. And now we can go back to Roblox just like so. And then what we can go and do is go to the top navigation bar in Roblox and go and tap on create just like this and um, wait for it to load. Now, if you haven't gone on tapped on create before, then you may go and get this big banner. What you need to do is tap on manage my experiences below start creating and then you'll be on this page here. Then you need to go to the right of my creations and go and tap on group creations just like so. And as you can see, here is the game that we've just saved and published at the moment. As you can see, it's set to private, which we need to change because otherwise people can't go and join it. So go and tap on private just like so. And then we can go and set it to public by selecting public and hitting save. And it's then saving the game. And there we go. So now you probably want to go and check it out in your group. So all you then want to do is go and tap on groups. And then here we are in the guide around subscribers group. But as you can see, it isn't actually appearing the game. So in order to go and make the game appear on your group, go to the top right of the group and go and tap on those three dots and click configure group just like that. Then you need to go to the left hand side and go and tap on settings on this sort of side menu here. Um, and then you, what you need to do is go to group profile and you need to go and enable group experiences are visible on the group homepage. Go and turn that on and it's going to go and say success, um, settings successfully updated. We can then go and press on the back button a few times and here we are on the group and you may need to go and refresh the group just like this. And as you can see experiences, we can then go and see the video guide just here and we can go and tap on it and wait for it to load. And then you can go and click play and people can go and play the game. If you found this guide useful, please go down below and consider subscribing. Peace.